Insanitarium is a insane asylum horror movie. <laughs> the movie is about this brother whose sister is stuck in this insane asylum. He cannot reach her anymore. For all he knows, she's dead. So he gets the bright idea to, hey, let's break in. And what better way to break in is to act like you're crazy. So this dude just pulls out all the stops. He gets put in the asylum. And yeah, once you're in, they start drugging you. And he's like, man, this is going a little too far. Sees his sister. And he tries to confess like, look, I'm a normal person. I'm not crazy. I, I made this note. So you know I had this was a big plan. And this was all set up. And basically the warden was like, nah, you are crazy. Shows them a forged fake note. Like, yeah, you didn't actually write a note. And they keep them heavily drugged. And basically now he thinks he's crazy. Is he crazy? Well, on to that later. And the warden. The warden is basically collecting people because he's experimenting on them. Basically has this drug or this nanites or something that basically is supposed to go to the part of the brain that causes anger and like neutralize it or something. Nonetheless, he's using it wrong or something because yeah, he starts affecting all of his patients with this what ends up eventually turning them into huh, these things spoilers that i'll talk about in the review because i'll really just get into big spoilers in the review just know this movie's crazy and yeah it's just him now trying to get out of this insane asylum while the warden has convinced everybody that dude is crazy and his plan kind of backfired but he still has to get his sister out. And then he met this cool ass dude in there. And just something's wrong with these patients. And he just beefed out with like. What didn't even make sense. Because he's like oh I'm a little crazy. And they're like oh throw him in with serial killers. So now like other patients that are serial killers. Want to kill this dude. Just a no bueno. Does he escape the asylum? You have to watch to find out. <laughs> so my review to Insanitarium and yes there is going to be spoilers so we're just going to start off with the big spoiler which I wasn't expecting and honestly I didn't mind it at all I actually really enjoyed this movie so but they become like zombies they become hungry for blood they're still like people they're not like they could get took down with like regular attacks and like shot to the like stomach or knee or something it's not like headshots or nothing but yeah they basically become zombies and it becomes a massive bloodbath as just this movie really just gets violent and gory and just chaotic right about the time when uh they start to make their escape from the asylum but there is a couple parts in this movie that were just crazy the first part was well just one of the parts was the uh the lady with the scar who's always naked she uh ate the security guards dick off that was pretty fucking crazy the one part when dude was petting that cat found his cat started petting it and ripped his head off and they started eating it that was crazy that was just a bloodbath when uh old girl sticks her arm in the cage and gets it ripped off and dude's just eating it that was crazy when they're going through like trying to escape and you just see the one chick eating her own intestine because they're just bloodthirsty that was crazy there's just a bunch of crazy bloody parts in this movie like this movie really just turns up it's crazy the acting was insanely good because it's a bunch of people acting like crazy people and this had that unsettling man these motherfuckers are crazy feeling like honestly like it was a really really good like asylum movie also 
And there were some actually well lit scenes in this movie. Was pretty surprised. I swear I've seen this movie maybe just the beginning though because I remembered it but I couldn't put my finger on it and then near the end I'm like I'm not sure if I've seen this movie but it felt super familiar and I swear I've seen it but who knows nonetheless I've seen it now and yeah just insanely crazy bloody just an intense ass movie from beginning to end honestly like this was just a really really good movie so my recommendation for Insanitarium and ooh, this is definitely a uh, highly recommended we're gonna say highly recommended for now but this was just a really really good horror movie like it had all the vibes it had everything like yeah just was really impressed with this movie so maybe like that's what's crazy like uh some of these uh highly recommended honestly i'll go back a week later and think about it like man that movie was actually a little better than i give it credit for so my opinion's always changing too on this shit and it's usually always for the best because i just love horror movies so for now highly recommended